The ship's doing its own motion, right? The ship's steaming through the water, doing its own thing, experience all the water physics. The, the help act is doing the same thing. So that small craft then has to overcome the water physics as it crosses into a sill, a fairly a dry sill in this case, but it has to come in, overcome those physics, and then reverse so it's not to slam into the ship. There's a lot of weight on this. So these guys do a really tough job. When, when, they, when they fly around, you literally can't see anything. You're relying mostly on your, on your navigation, on your radar. So with that, please. I can, I can like bring it down to layman's terms a little bit easier for the, for the XO. Uh, picture your house is moving and you got to park your car in your garage. However, your car is an air hockey puck. You're all familiar with air hockey, correct? And you're, you're maneuvering your air hockey puck that maneuvers on all three different axes into that garage while it's still moving. And then you have to stop said air hockey puck in a certain spot, in a certain time. That they can, anyway, uh, I'm Chief Robinson, Crab Master from the front boat up here. Uh, the LKX operate about 200 miles over the horizon range per fuel. Uh, four main engines, two engines for power. We can carry up to 60 tons uh, at speeds of in excess of about 50, 50 knots. It's all like, like the XO said, it is up on a big neoprene bag, if you will, bag skirt system, like you call it. It'll bring us, like the XO said, it'll bring us right up almost to the overhead. So we'll come in, we'll come in slow, like all the weight we have on deck right now, obviously you're not going to come in just take all the air off the bag because it's just a slam right down into the deck. So what we have uh, three main positions, you have your crab master, the driver, you have your engineer that runs the whole engineering plant, the fuel, the power, he's the guy that's bringing the boat up and down, and then your navigator is telling you where to go. Plus over on this side of the boat, on the port side, we have what's called the bubble. So all the driving is done from the starboard side over here. Uh, I can't see the left-hand side of the boat when we're driving. So we have a, a guy in that bubble right there that'll tell me whether or not we're gonna hit the ship when we're right behind him. That's his main, main job, make sure that the port side of the boat is uh, secure and he can see all that because I can't. Questions? I did that all in a nutshell, I did it really fast. If you want a specific answer for something, let me know.